A new high tech device makes sure water doesn't go to waste in this drought. Only on 5, KPX 5's Mike Sugarman shows us what's helping find the leaks in pipes. There's water leaking on Pennsylvania Street, the equivalent of five swimming pools a day. Roxy the Pomeranian seemed to know about it a few days ago before it got to the surface. Keeps walking it a couple feet into the street and sniffing along that line, and I couldn't figure out why she was doing that, and it turns out there's been a leak. That's a pretty low-tech way of finding a leak before it bubbles up. There are, of course, better ways. This system uses sensitive sensors to hear where water is rushing. Shouldn't be here. So there's a leak, and the city water department knows it has to patch it up. Pipes underground leak for all kinds of reasons. Sometimes they're just old, like this one. This was laid in 1893. Some city pipes were installed in the 1860s. 145 years later, a new device will be looking at them with the highest of high-tech eyes. It's called Smart Ball. And it rolls through the pipe, and as it rolls by, it uh, identifies and listens um, acoustically for leaks and air pockets. And a McKnight with PureTech says San Francisco is the latest utility to rent this one-of-a-kind device. It finds small leaks underground before they're big ones and ones that don't yet exist. We also use it to identify the failures of tomorrow or the condition of the pipe where leaks will develop in the future. It uses sound to save water. But at $400,000, is it a sound investment? We think so, because if once we proactively find one of these leaks and repair it, not only are we saving millions of gallons of water, but we also are preventing a large main break, which can cost $400,000 in one incident. This leak, by the way, stopped later in the morning. Roxy might have told them about it days ago. Mike Sugarman, KPIX 5. San Franciscans report over 900 leaks a year, millions of gallons of water wasted.